Uh, today, we have a, a very special uh, person. Um, uh, I don't like to call him a guest. Uh, he's a friend, uh, uh, a CCC client, uh, just an amazing, amazing uh, doctor of chiropractic, uh, Dr. Ray Omid. Welcome, Dr. Ray. Thank you. Honor and privilege to be here, Doc. And uh, for those of you that don't know, uh, Dr. Ray is one of the largest practices uh, on, the, on the East Coast. Uh, he's just rocking it. And uh, lives are being transformed in his practice. There's been signs and wonders and miracles, really, uh, on, a, on a daily uh, basis. And uh, Dr. Ray, uh, I'd like for you to talk uh, you know, about being part of CCC and, and how it's changed you uh, personally. Yeah, so it's transformed my life because number one, it puts things in right priority. Putting God first and everything in your life allows God to go to work in your life. And so oftentimes when we have God fifth and we put everything else first, the power of God can't demonstrate itself in the different areas. By joining CCC and getting advice from Dr. Shippen and Dr. Lerner, it became real clear that rather than following life according to my own will, that, that I followed life according to God's will, because his will is to create an abundant life in all areas of my life. And he knows how to operate my life better than I do. So through the instruction and guidance of Dr. Shippen and Dr. Ben Lerner and listening to the Holy Spirit guide me, I, my life has been transformed. Uh, my marriage has improved, uh, just ever the joy, the peace, the practice, my relationship with my friends has improved. It's gone to deeper levels of depth. The depth of these relationships have improved because of the investment into this program. And, and um, you, you know, Dr. Ray is going to be one of our uh, speakers uh, October 9th in Connecticut at our next uh, CCC event. And we're so pumped up and excited uh, that he's going to be speaking again. Last year in Connecticut uh, was amazing when he spoke. Uh, people's practices were improved and exploded by the different practical pointers uh, that he talked about. And Dr. Ray, can you give us some practical points that you'll be sharing uh, in October? Yeah, you know, one of the biggest revelations that I received is knowing that our patient base are the people that God entrusts us to shepherd, to take care of, to, as a pastor takes care of a flock, we are entrusted to take care of the patients that God has entrusted to us. So to recognize where it is that there needs to be improvement in our ability to communicate and to lead people into the light. And also uh, as an evangelist reaches out to souls to save souls, we have the ability to evangelize the truth about health and healing that is needed now more than ever. So the mindset of how we approach these things when we communicate to patients and we let them know that they need to bring in their family, their friends, their friends need to be part of this because we, we live in a society that's so heavily reliant on a model that's broken, that creates fear as its motivation, while what we're doing is creating love and faith and the principles of God that allow their body to be set free. And so one of the things I came to realize is that everywhere I talk, whether it's a church talk, whether it's a dinner talk, whether it's one-on-one -on -one with a patient interaction, it's the ability for me to recognize that they're part of this team. And so together we're gonna reach more people. And so when I'm speaking to somebody, I'm thanking them for their engagement in the culture and the practice. And I'm thanking them for the opportunity to have a partner in this mission that we can reach more people with. And the recognition that for every patient that comes in my office, that they're on my mind, I'm praying for them on a daily basis because they're part of the team that God has assigned for me to be able to reach more. And so for me, the, the practicality is when you are automatically seeing them in that light, then communication becomes evident for us to reach others. And so not only is it about them and their family, but it's about reaching others where they know that we can speak at. And you put them as part of that team and they get excited about it, that they can make a difference in the world that they now know a truth 
that the majority of the world is desperately needing sick and suffering because they don't have that truth. And so you're getting them to be part of that team. You see them as part of the team. God has instructed them so that they become your disciples. And as a disciple, you're creating them to become a mature believer in the principles that govern health. And as you're developing that maturity in them, then part of that maturity enables them to reach others with that message of life and health that only chiropractic can provide. That's awesome. That's so true. That is so true. Especially in the days that we're living in today with the, uh, pan, uh, with the pandemic and uh, all the lies that are being told by the uh, population, uh, not just in America, but obviously throughout the world. Mm. And, and, and spiritually, um, you know, as a, a, a doctor um, of faith, uh, as a principal chiropractor, uh, as a chiropractor leading um, a large office with other doctors that are part of your team, um, as long, you know, along with you know, the, the CAs and, and the other people that you have, uh, spiritually, uh, how, how does that work spiritually and how have, it's a twofold question and, and how have you grown, uh, spiritually, um, in the last, in the last year being part of CCC and also how do you see the, uh, the future of your of your practice. So I, I think that the most important thing, you know, as a as a chiropractor and a healer that I was called to be, I was always seeking and understanding the truth. I was seeking all sorts of outside in methodologies, new age practices, all these different um, teachers, if you will, because I seek that spiritual truth for so long. But once I came across the truth about the spirit of God and how the spirit of God can move in my life and in my practice, it, it demonstrated itself. My practice, you know, I, I share Dr. Schiffman, for those of the, that don't know, my practice went from 550 patient visits a week to 950 patient visits a week in a matter of 11 weeks. We went from having a full marketing team that didn't have the ability to bring in any more than one church talk every quarter to having opportunities present itself where patients would naturally just come up to us and say, hey, I have this church I'd like you to speak at. I'd like you to come to my church. And we went from having one every quarter to having four a month. I mean, the, the level of new patient growth went from 100 new patients a month to 240 new patients a month. There was supernatural growth that demonstrated itself. So, so what I became to recognize was that the spirit of God was moving in mighty ways, not only in my life, but through my talks and in the practice. The talks had this anointing power that we describe where the spirit of God is working. And I truly believe that every chiropractor who's reached a servant height level had somehow come into contact with that spirit power of God. And that what happens is when that spirit takes over, when we surrender ourselves to that spirit, everything just prospers around us. It's impossible to be in the presence of that anointing power and not have transformation take place. And so when I came to the understanding of how the Holy Spirit, the Spirit of God can work in my life, everything changed. And all of a sudden, there was a clear discernment and this is important, a distinction between everything that was to a degree counterfeit, that looked good on the outside. It had some good ideas about love, but it was counterfeit. And how I know that is the level of expansion and growth that took place, not naturally, not by works, but supernaturally by the spirit. The spirit revealed to me the difference. And I think that's so important because so many chiropractors have a pure heart 
and they're aiming to do the right thing, except they can be misled so easily by a counterfeit system. And so thank you, Dr. Shipman, and thank you, Dr. Ben Lerner, for clearing that out and leading me to the truth. Because in the past, I got to tell you that I got caught up in the spirit of religion. I got caught up in uh, the spirit of divination, which is new age practices. And I didn't know the difference. In fact, to be, to be frank, the spirit of divination looked like it offered more than the spirit of religion did growing up. But when I came across the true path, the spiritual path, the way as a follower and understanding how that spirit can go to work in my life, then there was a different level of joy, peace, strength, wisdom, power, and all these things are the foundational roots that allows everything to grow in your life, including the practice just took off. And during the pandemic, there was, uh, there was the, because I understood the laws that govern prosperity on a spiritual level, on a true spiritual level, on the true path, there was no depression, there was no recession. In fact, our practice was depression and recession proof because of Dr. Schiff and because of Dr. Ben Lerner. And I'm extremely grateful to be part of the CCC movement. And every chiropractor that has the calling to make a difference in their life needs to be part of this movement. And they will see the fruit that it bears because you can tell a tree by the fruit that it bears. We could tell a tree by the fruit that it bears. That means if you're confused about what's counterfeit, what's not, certain things sound good, there may be polished, look at the tree and you'll be able to tell. I tell patients in the doctor report all the time, we have medical doctors in different offices around our office, but look at the tree, look at the fruit that it's bearing. If patients are coming and they're still using wheelchairs and walkers and they're still on 18 drugs, they're not getting healthier. When you get healthier, you need less, not more medication. And in this case, when there's fruit, there's prosperity, there's blessing, there's a significant amount of effortless growth, which, which uses work, but work where there's maximum result with minimal effort, And that is the key. That's awesome. I definitely don't have anything to add from that because that, uh, that, that, that was awesome. That was awesome. And, and what's so amazing also, Dr. Ray, is that through the whole pandemic, like you were saying how, you know, with CCC, you increased, you expanded that all of our CCC uh, clients, <laughs> you know, so many uh, in chiropractic, unfortunately, their volumes drop, their prosperity drop, but everyone that's part of CCC all increased and expanded and improved uh, in a pandemic, in a pandemic. That's and uh, that, that, go ahead, Dr. Ray. I think for those people that have a chance to listen to this and, and may not know Dr. Ben Lerner personally or may not know you, Dr. Schiffman, personally, there's one thing I want to add because I've been in practice 20 years and I've been to a lot of different seminars and a lot of different coaching programs and I've kind of seen it all. And uh, in the maturity development within me, I came to recognize a very powerful team in you and Dr. Ben Lerner. And here's why. For those that are seeking skills, systems, processes, procedures, I think that Dr. Ben's wisdom and him being around for so long has really been able to refine wherever somebody's practice is and take them along that journey so that they can learn to walk before they run. And he is, in my opinion, the master at systems and processes and procedures, but all the natural without an understanding of the spirit and the supernatural it doesn't work the same way. And so when, when it comes to understanding the supernatural, the spirit realm and how that plays a role in growth in somebody's life, Dr. Schiffman, I've been around a lot of people, but there's very few people that in this field are walking your walk. And so I wanna acknowledge that you get the mastery level at the spiritual, the supernatural and the natural. And it's the same when you're listening and you talk to your patients is that there are natural laws that govern healing and health. And there are also supernatural words or laws that govern health and healing, including watching the words that come out of your mouth and what you're allowing in your eyes and ears. And so when a patient wants to get well, what you find is that they go to one and not the other. Oftentimes they'll go to church and they'll be prayed for and they'll understand some spiritual realm, but they don't get the laws like the law of alignment. 
alignment, that there's a power within you given to you by God that flows when your spine is in alignment. And then they can go to chiropractors and oftentimes they're missing the chiropractor that has the ability to put on that special, that extra something, that adjustment with that power of anointing where there's healing coming out of the hands and there's a glory in this space where there's an atmosphere change and just the presence is bringing about healing. Well, I believe it's the same with coaching, Dr. Schiffman. I believe that there are plenty of coaches out there that offer maybe one part of that, but never the mastery level of both combined. And I believe that God has brought you and Dr. Ben Lerner together for that reason, because even though you're both able, well able and competent to teach on skill and uh, the spirit, there's the level of talent that God has anointed each of you with that when it comes together allows for supernatural magnification, multiplication to say the least, you know, it's like things will get tenfold, thirtyfold, sixtyfold, a hundredfold return for their investment in sewing into price-centered chiropractic, which means showing up, making whatever investment necessary in time energy that they may show up. And for the, the, the amount that they put in to join and become a partner in the, the, the CCC movement will create hundredfold returns in their life. And I'm just so grateful. Uh, I can just keep speaking, but, uh, but I know we got a certain time limit here. So I'll let you take over. <laughs> Yeah, well, that's awesome. Thank you so much, Dr. Ray. Uh, Dr. Ben and I, we just appreciate you so much and all that you do for chiropractic and all that you've done for the CCC movement. Uh, it's just such a, such a blessing. So October 9th, everybody, Connecticut CCC event, uh, Supernatural Growth Mega Conference is going to be uh, just really uh, anointed, spectacular. And uh, Dr. Ray is going to be there speaking, uh, as long as with others that are impacting uh, their communities, just like Dr. Ray is. So uh, God bless you, everybody. Uh, thank you for joining us today. And uh, remember, with God, all things are possible. And we'll see you uh, October 9th in Connecticut.